Nope. It's it's really you know what the the days and stuff like that they keep pushing him back because of the scheduling and stuff. So he's not even telling me the August is a hundred percent. I mean, that's his desire, but we'll see what happens. You know, hey, it's like everything in life. Things just do happen. I mean, I took off today thinking I'd be down here with a trailer and three blocks down the road, you know, I got a, ba a tire and a bearing <laughs> shattered. So, But it's a blessing in disguise because it happened when I could get it right back home and just figure, okay, take it loose. It, it, it lost me 30 minutes of time was all it did. And I still got here early. Yeah. So I'd be here by four and it's a uh, quarter to four. So plan B is make a gate. Uh, just the frame part is all I need. I need a, a metal frame part so that I can mount the uprights yeah. on. I'll show you my little sketch. So all it'll be basically is a metal frame out of either C channel or L channel with uh, two big, huge, massive hinges on it. And what I can do that way, I can take the section of fence that I've been kind of using in a half-ass way and lifting it off and just swing it. Just swing it out of the way, back my trailer up. Technically, the, the village is letting me get away with it. I'm not supposed to keep a trailer parked in my driveway. So what I do during the season, I use it, I park it there, and they don't bother me. And I, when the season's over, I just kind of move it back in my backyard. So I figure since they're being nice about it. You want you need some help with that? You got it? Okay. See, next thing we do is we call up Tom and uh, see if he can get you, make a, make you an offer on that old plaz cutter of yours that he loved. <laughs> oh, How thick this will cut up to what what Inch size? And an Inch and an eighth. It'll cut through. Okay. Although the trailer didn't make it and it's going to be put to a rest, I will be picking up a new trailer. This is what he made for me here. Nice hinged plate. 